Joining me now from Burbank, California is Michael Berry. He's professor of contemporary Chinese cultural studies at UCLA, and he's the author of Speaking in Images, interviews with contemporary Chinese filmmakers. Thank you so much for joining us. A pleasure to be here. So we just saw these images of Michael Douglas and Bruce Willis starring these Chinese produced films. Matt Damon, another big name. Is this becoming a big trend among these Hollywood stars? Is it about the money or is it the market in China? I think it's a little bit of both. And although the trend is definitely picking up steam, it's something that's been happening for quite some time. You can look back 15, 20 years and see Donald Sutherland in Big Shot's Funeral, a film by Feng Xiaogang, uh, Christian Bale in Flowers of War by Zhang Yimou about a decade ago. So the trend has been happening, and it also happens both ways. So Hollywood films, especially a lot of the big action blockbuster films like Resident Evil, X-Men, Iron Man, a lot of these franchise films have all been casting Chinese actors as well. And so you really see these two trends now really coming together. Speaking about the Chinese box office record July, domestic films are very popular. They seem to be leading the way. Um, what is Hollywood learning from what they're seeing in China and what the moviegoers in China want to see? Well, I think that the one lesson is that there's very different cultural tastes among these different audiences. And Hollywood has been very successful historically with exporting their films to global audiences all around the world. Uh, China is no exception to that. However, as the Chinese film industry expands dramatically and starts making more and more features catered to the tastes of a local audience, there's, they're learning new ways to take Hollywood uh, techniques and internalize that and give it to local audiences in a way that's more palpable for them. So we see that there's this movie being filmed right now in China. Jackie Chan is the big star with John Cena, an American uh, wrestler and now turned actor. They're filming a movie called Project X. So do you see this uh, collaboration, I guess, as you will, sort of a, a, a good mixture of what both the United States and you know, Hollywood and China can do uh, together collaboratively. I, I think there's, you're going to see more and more attempts to make co-productions, to collaborate. A lot, there has been a lot of misfire. Some of these uh, films that are in production now, we'll have to wait and see about the production quality and how they bring things together. I think there's been a temptation to just follow the money and mash these two industries together in a way that often is not natural and does not create stories that are really engaging for audiences. And so it's a learning process, and they really need to find uh, more organic stories that are going to bring cast and crew and the creative expertise of these two very powerful industries together in a way that will push creativity forward and not push it back. All right, Michael Berry in Burbank, California.